Did you know that there is a strange new illness that affects humans and the result is an allergic reaction to red meat? If that isn't creepy enough, then you may be surprised to learn that the allergy is most commonly passed to humans from the bite of a tick. The correct medical term is alpha-gal syndrome, AGS, or mammalian meat allergy, MMA. It is a type of meat allergy characterized by a delayed onset of symptoms usually within 3 to 8 hours. The most common symptoms of AGS are hives, itchy rash, nausea and vomiting, heartburn and indigestion, diarrhea, stomach pain, cough, difficulty breathing, a drop in blood pressure, swelling of the lips, throat, tongue, or eyelids, dizziness or faintness. Anaphylaxis is a symptom of AGS, and can potentially be fatal. If anyone suspects they are experiencing symptoms related to AGS then they should immediately seek medical care. Alpha-gal syndrome is primarily associated with the bite from a lone star tick and most cases occur in central and southeastern regions of the US. The adult female lone star tick is best known for a star-shaped white spot on its back. However a male can have different variations of white. A 2012 study found unexpectedly high rates of alpha-gal allergy in western and north-central regions of the US, which seems to suggest that unknown tick species may spread the allergy. In other countries, other ticks have been associated with AGS. There has been at least one confirmed instance of a man with alpha-gal allergy going into anaphylaxis after receiving a heart valve transplant. In 2020, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration approved genetic modification of pigs so they do not produce alpha-gal sugars. The FDA awarded a Maryland-based lab permission to use their pigs on people. The company is exploring a mail-order business to send people refrigerated packages of alpha-gal-free bacon, ham, ground pork, pork chops and shoulders to people affected by the syndrome. Pigs developed with the trademark name Gallsafe may be able to be eaten safely by people with alpha-gal allergy, and may also be used to produce alpha-gal-safe drugs, and their organs may be used for xenotransplantation. The discovery of the origin of AGS was first linked to the United States by Thomas Platts Mills and Dr. Scott Commons in 2002. During their research on the alpha-gal allergy link with the cancer drug Cetuximab, Platts Mills was bitten by a tick and developed AGS which literally led to their discovery. Ever since this discovery cases worldwide have been on the rise. New data released by CDC shows that up to 450,000 people in the US may have been affected since 2010. Due to the fact that AGS cases are not nationally notifiable to CDC, the exact number of cases are unknown. In 2021, it was reported that AGS is unfortunately becoming pretty common. There is currently no known cure for AGS. If you are interested in seeing more content like this please like and subscribe.